Gary Dean Premium Mobile Services.com. Um, this is a 17 foot Regal. You can see the oxidation on the boat. So today I'm going to do a two step correction on this gel coat as well as clean the interior. You can see how bad the transom area is. Boat's very chalky. A little bit damp from the uh, morning dew. Gotta get the uh, interior taken care of. All the vinyl is gonna get cleaned. Carpets cleaned, stuff like that. Get some of that mold off there. All right, I'm about to start polishing. I got the interior to a point where uh, it's all clean and nice. I just gotta go back in and vacuum the uh, carpet again uh, after it dries up some and give everything a good wipe down. So I got her taped up for some 50-50 shots. I'm gonna use the uh, Makita 9227C and uh, some uh, premium finish care four star products Avenger wool pads to do my cutting. And then I'll uh, polish it probably with the DA. I'm not sure yet. Uh, we'll have to see. You know, you never know what you're gonna use until uh, you A, try a few different things to see what you uh, get the best results with. But beyond that, um, the finish, you know, the, uh, the actual gel coat or the paint that you're working on um, will really determine uh, what, what you're gonna end up finishing with uh, just because uh, different polishes and compounds react differently to different situations. Uh, so anyway, I'm gonna start out with the wool pad, which that is their, uh, not their most aggressive wool pad. That's their, um, their like a medium wool. It cuts really well, uh, but uh, it's still a wool pad. So, you know, obviously it's gonna cut uh, they also have an aggressor, which is supposed to be a uh, much more um, aggressive wool pad. I have those as well. All right, I did 50-50 uh, for you. You can see where I've separated it and I've compounded this side. I haven't polished it yet, but it's definitely uh, coming out really nice. All right, now we have this section of the top of the boat polished. You can see much glossier. Um, got it all smoothed out and shiny. You can see where the uh, tape line was. This side's all nasty and chalky. This is smooth and glossy. And that's what we're looking for. All right. Got a lot of the hull done. The bottom portion. I still have to do the uh, top of this side, and the part I got part of the transom area done. This side's done. Um, it's not any more gloss to be had. It's pretty beat up uh, by the sun. You can see how bad this side is, and it looked just like that over here. So it looks a lot better. All right, the boat's all finished. Nice and glossy. You got two steps of polishing. I compounded it and then I polished it. And then I did the interior. All the vinyl got cleaned and then uh, protected with 303 aerospace protectant. I did the interior windows. Transom area was cleaned as well. 
This old boat was neglected, but it's nice now. Nice and glossy. Thanks for watching.